Whether complimenting a meal, relaxing, or entertaining, cocktails and spirits can spark your dining and social experiences. Join celebrity tastemakers beyond the bar as we mix this week's liquid recipe for the sip. I'm Kaylin Monty, Beyond the Bar, an American Cut with Gemma Cole, who's going to shake and stir us through this week's featured cocktail. Gemma, what are we mixing up? A new friend. This is a variation of an old pal cocktail. And only three ingredients. An old pal is originally made with rye whiskey, so Tullamore Dew 12 year special reserve works exceedingly well. And the spices of this are a little more notable. Yes, so you do get a little bit of bitterness, sweetness, and then you also get a hint of spice from the Irish whiskey. Let's begin. Start with one ounce of dry vermouth, one ounce of your Italian orange liqueur, not too bitter and not too sweet, 50-50 flavor-wise. And lastly, Tullamore Dew 12 year special reserve, one ounce. Fill your glass with ice and stir until the cocktail is cold. Strain your cocktail. And the last part, take a nice thick cut of your orange brand it in half over the cocktail and give it a little spritz. And you can see the beautiful drops of orange oil on the top of your drink. It's a beautiful color. It's like a neon summer drink. For a drink with three spirits, it is very easy. And I expected the vermouth to be pretty aggressive, but the orange and the tully are softening it. You should be able to pick out the flavors of each ingredient and neither one should be more overpowering than the other. It's like an adult gummy bear. It is. With the orange coming through. It's definitely a lot more approachable than a typical martini would be. Gemma, I have a new friend. Thanks to an old pal. For your new friend, visit CelebrityTasteMakers.com for events, updates, and giveaways that take you beyond the bar. I'm Caitlin Monty, and until next time, here's to you from the SIP.